Well, the game is over. Um, we report in this win. We end the Jim Harbaugh era with a 20 to 17 victory over the Arizona Cardinals. Uh, but very quickly after the game, there was a, a press release, um, you know, put out there from the 49ers and from Jim Harbaugh, both mutually pa uh, parting ways. Um, there was no, I guess you can say, no bitter words thrown um, from Jed York or Jim Harbaugh in the post-game uh, interviews, just basically saying that you know they're both going in different directions. Jim Harbaugh put over everybody in uh, the organization from the uh, front office to the uh, the players that he's coached. Uh, 49 career wins uh, with the San Francisco 49ers. It's a great way to part ways, he said. But uh, honestly, in my ways, I remember uh, the, the head coaches that we had, and I knew that um, you know Jim Harbaugh was a big part of the um, the puzzle to put us together, to put us into the playoffs, put us over the hump uh, for so many years. You know, basically, they just said that. Um, the Niners were a team on the uprise. They were a good young team, uh, and it took uh, us getting Jim Harbaugh to put us into that groove in order to, uh, you know, get us to where we were. He made the uh, the, the gut check uh, decision to sit Alex Smith, put Colin Kaepernick in there, making him our uh, career um, future quarterback. Alex left. He went to uh, Kansas City. You can see from Kansas City's. Uh, record that you know Alex Smith still is a good quarterback over there with Alex with Andy Reid, and um, you know they're moving in the right direction. But we moved in, uh, put in a lot of great players in a lot of spots. Um, there definitely is a gloom feeling over the 49er Nation right now with Harbaugh leaving us. Um, I thought that the announcement would come immediately after the game that he was signing with Michigan. I've heard rumors that Harbaugh will be flying to Michigan to sign the deal in Ann Arbor on Tuesday. Um, I think that the Oakland Raiders um, are, are definitely going to want to get a phone call into Harbaugh before that to see if they can keep him in the NFL. Um, Harbaugh you know, was a guy, I believe, at San Diego, San Diego State before he transferred uh, from there to uh, the Stanford job. Uh, so he does know, you know in college, you know, the recruiting and the 24-hour uh, uh, schedules that goes into all of that. Um, you know, Michigan is the school where he went to school is on the mater to try and get them back together. But Michigan is a team that's been rebuilding for years. I remember when um, Rodriguez, I, I think that was the coach's name that went there from West Virginia or something like that. That was 10 years ago at least. And he was the guy that was supposed to put them over the hump to get them back to where they were. And, you know, it's been coach after coach after coach. And um, Harbaugh's never really been a guy who's gotten in trouble. I just watched the U part two. Uh, and, and I watched the U a couple uh, weeks ago, uh, the, the ESPN 30 for 30 docs about Miami's troubles. And um, you, can, you can get in a lot of trouble in collegiate sports, man. Everybody knows that it's corrupt. You can pretend that guys aren't letting certain things happen there. But uh, I think in order to win in college sports, you have to cheat. And um, I just would hate to see Harbaugh get caught up in something like that. And um, that's the only thing that's really on my mind is will Harbaugh cheat? And of course, Harbaugh will cheat and bring guys in under you know, certain deals. And you know, money guys will get paid for boosters under the table. And, just got to hope that he can do it. I wish him well-being. Um, you know, he got my Niners over the hump, took us to the Super Bowl, took us to the NFC Championship games. Nothing really more I can ask for from him. Uh, I just wish that he would stay. <laughs> Please stay, Jim. Does that work? <laughs> uh, no, it doesn't. But um, you know, I've heard rumors that the Niners promoting their defensive coordinator, getting the defensive coordinator from the Arizona Cardinals, getting the offensive corner from the Seattle Seahawks. I don't see either of our competitions helping us out. I think well, basically if someone enters your, is in your division trying to sign one of your coordinators, you give those coordinators head coach money to stay. You don't let somebody from your own team beat you and um, see what happens from there. And as long as we don't get Rex Ryan, I think we'll be all right. But um, it hurts to see Harbaugh leave. Peace out, everybody.